Hello everyone, I am the Mal for the South. We are back here today with another reaction video and Worm Shepherd, one of my favourite bands and one of the best up and coming bands in all of Deathcore, but especially in Symphonic Black in Deathcore, and in my opinion, the blackest of Symphonic Black in Deathcore, Worm Shepherd. They are just about to drop a brand new song entitled The River. Of Spell OV, which my, the woman of my life, she fucking hates that, and I love annoying the fuck out of her with it. The River of Knives, and I could not be more fucking gassed for it. It is gonna be fucking insane. The last three songs they've dropped of Sword and Nail, Chalice of Rebirth, and oh, the name escapes me. What a bastard. Ritual Hmm. We are here at the premiere. I am rambling a little bit because I've, as of recording this, I've still got like a minute 27 left to go. So, um, I'll see you in a second. All right, we're here. I uh, paused it because I went and got a drink and then I was like five seconds over. So the song had already started. I don't think I've, I like anything actually started to play. It's just like the unique leader thing. So we are here. Worm Shepherd, the River of Knives. Let's fucking do this. I'm excited for this one. I'm excited. Brandon told me this is the one. This is the one. So, I'm gassed as fuck. Ooh! That's new! Oh! Wow! The Malachi Black? Oh, the devil's spot now! Already? Oh, he's matching! David Vocally is matching the guitar tone! Uh, wow! He's carrying the melody of the guitar! That's brilliant! Those are some nice riffs, you know! This tunnel is so good. I hear that little lead, I hear that. Whoa. Fuck 
He's playing us out. Oh, it faded. Wow, that faded a lot quicker than I expected it to. I wanted the symphony to play us out. That was five and a half minutes. I could have had seven. I could have had seven. That was great. Man, I'm out of shape. Woo! What a fucking track. What a fucking track. This sword has nearly killed me twice now. Once into the hellfire. And now once for Worm Shepherd. So Worm Shepherd just once again proving why they are one of the best deathcore bands out there. And when I said at the beginning of the video that they are the most blackened of symphonic blackened deathcore, like you think of Mental Cruelty, you think of Lorna Shaw, you think of Worm Shepherd, yada yada yada. They are the most blackened in my opinion, like, you can really, really see the black metal influences there. I mean, Devon had the coolest fucking corpse paint ever, in my opinion. Like, he wore it for the Accursed video. And also in Ragnarok, back when it was Devon to Embers, which was really fucking cool. I fucking loved that song. That song's killer! But, yeah, he had the coolest corpse paint I'd ever seen. And it was one of the first times where I actually saw corpse paint and was like, yeah! I, if I saw that guy in the woods, wouldn't fuck with him. Wouldn't fuck with him. But goddamn, what a track. What a track. It had its awesome blackened elements. There were these really sickly, sinister talking moments where Devin just, like, really channeled his inner uh, Dickie Allen and just went full goblinoid, just, I'm summoning a demon and all that kind of stuff, which is fucking great. The, the music video, uh, Who Let Them Play In That Church? Big questions. And also, I fucking love that kind of, like, the ram head imagery kind of thing. It's what my logo is based off of. And, like, you, m immediately makes me think of Malachi Black, which, again, Devin, I know you're a huge fan of 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 the graps, of AEWs, of WWE. So, I, I, I see you. I see you. But also, damn, there was some really good riffing at, uh, at times. There were some really nice lead parts, which were kind of hidden in the mix. But when you found them, they really, really, like, brought something new to the song. Now, let's talk breakdowns. So I know my good friend Bartholomew Reginald Eckbert, Anchorbert, Kingsley, Dilly, and Ophelius Winston, Nigel III, has already actually, you know, made the compilation and the top 10 list of the best breakdowns of this year. Expect to see all top 10 videos actually on the 31st of this month. They are all dropping on New Year's Eve. But other than that, in that video, I have very good sources that tell me Bartholomew stuck in there of Sword and Nail by Worm Shepherd because it's one of the best breakdowns of the year. This just topped it. It fucking topped it. Now, I know 
uh, that Worm Shepherd have been compared to Lorna Shaw quite a bit, which is fair enough to say you could say the same for Mental Cruelty, but I just think that's because Lorna Shaw are A, one of the biggest deathcore bands in the world right now, B, they are the forefront of symphonic black and deathcore, have been for a long, long time, and it feels like no band can follow in that suit without people immediately bitching and going, Oh my god, I'm just copying Lorna Shaw! Let's shut the fuck up. But! Ooh! Devin, I see you, boy. I see you. Because that that snarly growl. So we all know that Will did, Will Ramos, he did the high snarls into the hellfire. <laughs> and Devin just went, you know what? Fuck you. I'm going to do my own snarls and it's going to sound like a ravenous pit bull just chewing on meat. Ooh! Dirty, filthy, disgusting stuff, but it's killer. Fucking killer. I see what, Bra Brandon, I see what you meant. Like, this, this is, this is the one. This is the one. And I, I'm with you. I'm with you, brother. Because fuck yes. This is, this song hits different. It hits different. Move over Accursed. Because this is now, in my opinion, the Worm Shepherd song. Accursed was kind of like their song. You wanted to know what Worm Shepherd sounded like? You sent them Accursed. Now you send them the River of Knives, and you say, this is Worm Shepherd, and this is the future of fucking Deathcore, and it's in good fucking hands. Anyways, thank you everyone so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed. Please like, share, subscribe. Do some naughty things in the comments down below. Let me know what you thought of the track. Let me know what you think of Worm Shepherd. Let me know what you think of me. And other than that, you've been wonderful people. I have been the man for the South, and as always, you guys are the real motherfucking heroes, and I am out of here, y'all. Boom! <laughs>